Good evening, everybody. A baby girl strapped in her stroller splashes into a pond and her older sister jumps in to try to save her. Firefighters pulled the baby from the cold water after she had been underwater for about 30 minutes. Local 12's Anjanette Levy joins us live from Children's Hospital where the baby was flown. Anjanette. Yeah, Kimmy, the baby was flown here to Children's earlier today from Westchester, and tonight there's been no official update on her condition. She was underwater for nearly 30 minutes, and tonight her neighbors are hoping for the best. I think somebody killed or drowned or something. Can you call somebody who knows swimming? Can you please? A neighbor placed the frantic call to 911 just before 2 o'clock. She heard screaming coming from the retention pond behind her house. When firefighters arrived, they found out a nine-month-old girl was underwater, strapped in her stroller. Apparently, they were uh, doing a, uh, having a walk uh, around. It's paved back there, and I guess the, um, uh, from what I understand, that the uh, stroller uh, got away and and rolled down the uh, the hill. Firefighters found the baby in water between six and ten feet deep. The neighbor who called 911 said the baby's older sister and another neighbor jumped in the cold water to try to find her. It's bad enough for any drowning and for it to be a child is, uh, is even more difficult. The baby's stroller went into the water off of a walking trail that neighbors use daily. Megan Hamilton used the trail shortly before the incident. I went out about um, 1.30. Um, it's a three mile loop so ran out with the dog and uh, lots of people out just walking. Um, walking their dogs, walking their kids, and no commotion. Neighbors stayed close to one another throughout the evening, hoping for the best for the baby girl and her family. And I can't imagine what that family is going through. It's horrible, and I know all the neighbors are very concerned about the family and the baby and praying that everybody's safe. Now, that pond water was incredibly cold, and the assistant fire chief is hoping that that actually might help this baby survive but as I mentioned there's been no official update on her condition tonight. Now we were told that the neighbor who actually tried to jump into the pond to save the baby um, was in there for just about 30 seconds. That's all she can ta could take and that could tell you just about how cold this water was but obviously it's been an incredibly difficult day today for those neighbors and especially the family of this little girl as they wait to find out if she survived. Reporting live from Children's Hospital, Anjanette Levy, Local 12 News. Cammie? All right, Anjanette, thank you. And as you could probably see in the video, the retention pond did not have a fence around it. People who live in the neighborhood say they can't recall any children falling into it in the past.